I need to find animals for my new zoo, but which should I go? I could use help from you. So pick this way or that way and help me to find some beasts of a very unusual kind. Now I need to find beasts to fill up my new zoo, but there's so much to choose from, I need help from you. Should I go get a Sneech or a cute Barbaloot who is dancing around in his Barbaloot suit? Or a glove-wearing Snuff? Or a tall birthday pet? Won't you help me to pick the next one I should get? So Gerald McGrew set right off for the beach, where he knew he would see a nice beach-loving Sneech. Not a plain-bellied Sneech, he'd want one with a star. And for star-bellied Sneeches, you had to go far. If you must have a star-bellied Sneech for your zoo, help me fix my machine, and I'll get one for you. This pattern I've made has a few empty spaces, so find the right shapes, put them in the right places, and then you'll have fixed up my shapes on machine, or my name's not Sylvester McMonkey McBean. Help Sylvester McMonkey McBean fix his shapes on machine. Click on the shape that comes next in the pattern. Great job! Play one more time, then young Gerald McGrew will have star-bellied speeches to take to his zoo. I knew you could do it. some more patterns and when you are through some star-bellied sneeches will come to my zoo One more time, then young Gerald McGrew will have star-bellied speeches to take to his zoo. Great job! some more patterns and when you are through some star-bellied sneeches will come to my zoo
say one more time, then young Gerald McGrew will have star-bellied stitches to take to his zoo. You did it! patterns and when you are through, some star-bellied sneeches will come to my zoo. One more time, then young Gerald the Groove will have star bellied stitches to take to his zoo. Great job! more patterns and when you are through, some star-bellied sneeches will come to my zoo. One more time, then young Gerald McGrew will have star bellied stitches to take to his zoo. I knew you could do it. Some more patterns, and when you are through, some star bellied sneeches will come to my zoo. You did it. One more time, then young Gerald McGrew will have star bellied speeches to take to his zoo. The 
sneeches have stars and that makes them all happy. So pick out some sneeches to take to your zoo and I'm sure they'll be happy to go there with you. Every sneech on the beach is delighted to say that we each have a shape of belly today. And if you had a shape on your little belly, we would take you along to the Good Girl Zoo. We are star-bellied sneeches and we sing out loud, we're the best on the beaches, so we're very proud. We don't like to give speeches, but you know it's true, if you'd like to be just we ask you. When Gerald returned to the Seussville Town Square, he was happy to see that his friends were all there. Ladies and gentlemen, small children too, I'm happy to welcome you to my new zoo. Then the people rushed in, and they stopped, and they gawked at the strangest odd creatures that ever have walked. They were also surprised that they swallowed their gum. Where did Gerald McGrew get these animals from? He traveled the world the, from the east to the west just to make his new zoo, the McGrew Zoo, the best. Gerald now is the greatest of all the McGrew's. So what will he do next? Anything that he chooses.